Guess what it is at two minutes after six o'clock this beautiful Tuesday morning being the 2nd of April 2024 and as you can see on your television screens that's the Central Business District commonly known as CBD. We are broadcasting live from Mass Media Complex along the Willy Siboni Road. As you can see, it's like a little bit of 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 a little bit Yalo Kanako Navaratar, who killed Kanako Yone Yabo for a bit. Mela Kawiti, because no son of Kakono. My say good morning. Good morning and happy birthday. Thank you so much. April, April, new month, um, new week. Very excited. How are you feeling for this month? 14 days to my birthday. Very happy. You're a big birthday celebrator? Not really. So this year we're a big birthday celebrator. I'll think about it. Otherwise, how was your weekend? It was, was it very good. good. Holidays? I rested, got to see family, um, friends. I think that was the best thing I can say. Mm -hmm. We just rested. Same here. So I'm quite happy How about was that? that? It, it was good. It was good. Okay. And uh, it's so funny how I'm not going to go to on Saturday and Sunday. I'm going to go jacket. That's how cold it is. Let's not look at the steady moi moi. How 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 far we are going to house up para cope. Okay. Right now. So winter has already arrived there, mm -hmm. and now winter is coming all the way. Yale na ketla ata seva kase. Kero ti medi sa matula kanya arna ti mala Botswana breakfast show proudly sponsored by Botswana Post that comes to you every weekday at 6:08 a.m. bringing you all the information that you need. Kibi do ane ledi la that's up. And we're going to be bringing you everything. Um, hopeful and full of laughter as we want you to start this month on a beautiful note on a positive note i i know we had quite a bit yeah. of a, a long weekend and it was somber it had a lot of good there's a lot of heaviness that yeah. um befalls on us but you know what let's keep the uh, the vibes positive most definitely yes. and talking about uh, keeping fit and a healthy lifestyle we're going to check out uh, Kickboxing actually. It had a lot of homies came in the road and when I got out some of the nets, I met some of the country that are so let's say the better some other rack of quality were boat cruise and most importantly have my second interview a bit later after the 7 a.m. news where I'll be talking to people of Cat Leapy products by the Horama by the Bahantalum, Little Nets, I met Akasi Engineering and Innovation. When on your side, all right, today we'll be talking about project management as you know, Hore, Kenako, Hore, Anum, my dear, so we're getting into the 2024. Yeah. 2025 financial year so we've got some um, specialists um, with the project management awareness what's mm -hmm. very important about as you're starting to make plans for this project what do you need and how they can help you and that will be happening in this hour and then later obviously we'll be mm -hmm. still discovering Botswana will be at Lion Rock mm -hmm. so make sure that this show will be jam-packed for you but first of all we start moving Definitely. our bodies right and getting fit with some kickboxing let's get fit with and guess what thanks to be pumas. Yes. <laughs> Let's check this out. <laughs> Good morning. Welcome to Get Fit Be Pumas. My name is Becky. Uh, today's session is box or kick. So we're going to learn how to box, how to kick. It's a cardio session. Okay. So we're going to sweat and punching at the same time. Okay. Ah. Uh, are you guys ready? Because hey, I'm super. Okay, now, we're gonna start right here, watch me. This is how you're gonna stand. Always remember, soft knees, back squeeze, now your guts, I'm right here. Okay, so you're gonna use the punch. So your punch comes from your hip there. When you punch, you twist your hip and back, twist, and back, okay. This is your basic, basic, and basic, okay. Now we go four, two, three, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Remember, you hear one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, let's go. One, 
two, three, four, straight punch, five, six, seven, eight, take it back, let's go, one, two, watch me, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, now, uppercut, let's go, one, take it down, and up, we go, one, two, three, four, stay with me, five, six, seven, eight, we go, one, two, three, four, basic, five, six, seven, eight, my heel, one, two, watch it, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, now your punches, diagonal, let's go, one, two, remember, your first punches, now diagonal, one, two, three, four, five, six, now how is it Need some more on the side. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. You go up and down. Let's go. One, two. Watch my guys. Three, four. You punch, then you take it back. We go. One, and back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, give me your uppercut. Straight back. One. Two, that will be three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, let's go. Three, four, five, six, seven. I know it's baby. Let's go. One, keep going. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, now, you're gonna give me one knee forward and back, one knee forward and back, okay? Four, three, two, let's go. One, watch my arms, two, let's go. Three, take it up, four, let's go. Five, we go. Six, up, 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 your knee. One, take it up, crunch it, one, let's go. Two, your arms up, three, let's go. Four, push it up. Five, let's go. Six, again. Seven, I'm going. One, take it up, let's go. Two, we go. Three, up. Four, go. Five, let's go. Six, yes. Seven, now. Eight, relax. Okay, guys. That was good. That was good. And thank you guys for watching. If you have missed, Today's session, log on to uh, Big Poma's page, uh, then you see everything, guys. Remember, you can do everything, say, Usmula Content, repeat three times, okay? Oh, and thank you, guys. See you next time. Big Poma's, Rikante, when I'm number one, Abo Tson, Abo Tle. Well, that's so much to meet our little moho, more baking and more to the Yadi Mela was on a breakfast show. Let me like you, Bura Carabo, Miss Cable, Senator Gorsa Jello, Tamis, Hamago Cotas, Jello, Haran Catel, and Water Tadi Bella, the Talabella Jello, Colo Hotel, Abotona Table Tennis Association, Bello, or Banaba Simon Lajello, Week One, yeah, the Phoenix Assurance, Mirta Waha Perlebella Jello, the ongoing. 30 tournament e long hore e tsware tso jalo ka go notane khotsa ta lebella metsame go ya chess ga reng ga tse dingwe re lebelle jalo botsana premier league hona le metsa hona le metsa yo ke long hore ya tsame ke ha ga re ga beke des tv premiership english premier league the lock standings ke dingwe tse long hore re tadi lebella jalo mo tsetse la go mpeko ha re lebile jalo tsone e le tsame Kidding with the Telo Horrico Bodi Torres, Hamoraja Loho Lebella, the NBA, as we are nearing the playoffs. Yes, the Hovana Jalororan, Merati, which is which. But anyway, my director is way ahead of me. Arsimil Level Lega Colo Hotel was on a table tennis association by Long Horn, but about Simola Jalo, week one, Yabuane, Elia, the Phoenix Assurance League. Okay, Telo Horem Motagar, the talking point was on Honecaco in the Lubaho Malobella, Elo Horrocono, Mana Athena, Mitamoko Yahoo, Yote. 
le gore e ne e rulagantswe re tla ba re nantse re batsetse mora go bane ba le khotela botsena table tennis re se go go bana gore ke ntse le gore eh ba se dira metshamo ka bona ta ba tshoretse ko kae o ka gakologalwa le gore e na re um ha tshoretse o se bona le ke a bona ga nna le postponements here and there postponements here and there but finally the league has started yeah and i'm i'm hoping this is going to go on a very successful year yeah. last year when yeah. I may as much as he did today to what that's a Yeah, give on a ball long for how we are going to learn and I want to learn what I love to learn table tennis it's a lovely to learn to go 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 ne mema ne ba ikutwa ka tselentse nyang mara go ga week 1 to ta ebile ne le gore ke go ba utwela ya longa re tsomo go bona re tsana jalo go go ba le khotela ba tsana tennis association ba long gore ba tshogedise jalo mitshame ko yone ele ya J30 tournament o ke tsela re bonye motshame ke wa mono ga ke bua ka esimwe le fe a khona go fanya jalo Jaden Samas go tsenga kwa la hatsela South Africa fanya jalo 622661 go ipanna patha jalo ka go the round of 16 okay jalo go re nne ba hetsa go tshamika jalo round of 32 ya nne re batla go bona gore gone ke ba he ba leng gore ba ipanna patha jalo ka go round of 16 simole feni le mongwe ba tshamike ba mono gae ba leng gore ba ne ba ipanna patha gone ke go pela hare ka go lebella me tshamiko e leng gore ya tshamike wa jalo mo se tsela go mpe ko btv sport ne le ka go mo tshamiko o wa ga e simole fe ga mmogo jalo le jaden samas go tsenga ko South Africa. Uh, first set it was I played really well and then second set he was playing really well um, because now the balls were like not moving because they were like when balls get older the balls move slower so he was taking advantage of that and then third set when we got new balls I started playing even better because now it's fast balls and I love playing with fast balls. The set I think as he just started playing really well started sort of very well I think I was a little bit nervous Second set I calmed down a little bit I started playing the new the all the balls started slowing the game down which is what I liked and the third set I as he just played too well Um so definitely we were working on stepping a lot more in playing a lot more aggressive and I think that worked really well today I took all the time away from her so she didn't have a lot of time to react to the balls and I think that worked really well and I will be definitely using that again in the next matches It was a tough match she played really well I I felt like I didn't have any solution against her. She's a really good player and it was a tough match today in the office. It was a tough day in the office. If you have time, you should pass by Northern Courts. Yeah. Yeah. In one of the days. Yeah. 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 Yeah o bana jalo gore mitshamo ka mengwe le gore ten chelsea chaka nyuka o ta ba kopana jalo le lenwa bo majaka harun van weika ta kopana le ditsogo fatso ba paletswe me re ta bona jalo magriza a magariza a kopana jalo le milian chapel teresa chelsea a kopana jalo le eden otken go na jalo le bo kotova o ta kopana jalo le rugara ga mmogo jalo le balotha ta kopana jalo le churu mumimba ke mengwe a mitshamo ko ya ba setsana le gore ta bo etshamikiwa eh bana jalo bana bo mono ga e gore le bona ba temo Chelsea tsheka nyuka ke bang ba ile gore ba bona gone ka go gore o bona gore from Ghana ko me tsame ko nya African Games ba ta ba re tsholetse eng me ha le bana jalo ka go go ba rre gore le bona ba ta bo ba ntse ba tsholetse eh re ta bona jalo eh mo tsame ke wa ga Rain van Lan a kopana jalo le Mark Nawa e le mo tsame ke wa mono ga Alexandra ta kopana jalo le Armstrong Bradley eh o na jalo le Van Wyk me go na jalo le Daniel Nota ta kopana jalo le Tumani ekana mema kana ka watha na jalo le sa bonga jaka israel dowi o ta kopana jalo le sen o lutle senti o ka gona ka go ba bana jalo gore bo makna wa ba ta ira ka tselentse njang re lebile jalo tsonetsa j30 tournament e le gore e tsweletse jalo ka go notwane court Arts jalo mo go bona ba Botswana Tennis Association re lebele jalo go go ba le khotela Botswana Chess Federation ba le gore this past holiday is bana ba le ka go phalape ke le gore bana ba tshore jalo the Metropolitan second round okay jalo gore ha o lebile jalo gone mo go ba chess re bona jalo na le di marape le gore ke ana a hetsa a le go dimo mo le bala ka go le thakore la bo re gore providence wa tlotse ke no heditse jalo a le ka go dimo ke jalo gore tare in 3 weeks 
Patrick se bere bona go tsana jalo third round e le gore tabo e le yone e khutisang jalo metshameko yone e le ya chess ya the metropolitan mo le bella jalo gore ka go basetsane top 10 ke yone e le gore e tabo ya ka go the final se gona jalo le na le di marape gona jalo le na talibanda e gona jalo le utimile maya gona le mashorobo a rona gona jalo le sa red gona le ga ba tshwane re file not sepsa but be separate but then uh, sister to sepsa but then who plays table tennis so <laughs> um sepsa re batin ne gona jalo le mosu a tang ke bona ba ile gore mothakare the top 10 e gara lwa jalo ke phobe ke bona ba ba tabo mba ya go tshameka jalo the final round e le gore tabo e le the final spill re ka le balla jalo gore gone mista pa sa bose chaba se tabo se tsana le mo campaign ya ka ba tabo ba ipankanya tsa metshameko e le gore e me tona tona mothakare ya lo e le yone ya chesa a tsa ma go tsa chesa le balla jalo ko kholeng ya dina gore mara ga gore go tshamikiwe la bothano la la mathatso sontaga lock standing cdm me ka tseletse nja re semela jalo ka liki e kgolwane ya botswana premier league o ka itsele gore go monate go go dimo le kota se go tshwana hela me ha le bella jalo gore go go dimo go eme ya sta passage one galaxy ba le gore ba ne ba fanya niko united ka nnotse pedi go e lengwe ba go go dimo bana jalo le 47 points township plus ba ne ba bua ko mara go gabe dimo motsame ko ngwa bona ba 11 angels can no send no se pedi nka itse lorma palestina ba sport number 2 ba na le points you know galaxy they have a game in hand uh, that game is against the beat of 11 mo le bella jalo mo sport number 3 ke ga bona ni united ba ne ba fenya morupule wa ntras ka no tse tharo go lengwe ba na le 37 points match minyenga traffic ba ne ba fenya holy ghost ka no lengwe go le fela they are sport number 4 ba na le 30 points mr passa security systems ba ne ba fenwa ke vtm ka no tse pedi go lengwe ba na le 28 points on sport number 5 number 6 ke swa flamingos ba ne ba fenya beat of ka notse pedi go ilengwe eh stopa sa 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 flamingos bana le 24 points wa rapa united mara ha go tsame ka maleka le fela le fela le masitoka bana jalo le 24 points me ha le balla jalo tse dingwe bidi of tata matebele mara ha gore ba fengwe ke police 11 ka no ilengwe go le fela number 8 ka 24 points bidi of 11 22 points vtm bana jalo le 20 points masitoka number 10 11 I'll tell you. 11 angels on spot number 12. Bana Jalo le 19 points. Number 13 ke police 11. Bana le 19 points. Hanna hoti li ki yeme. Murupul. Holy Ghost tito ta. Nere ba la yela. Nere la yela. Murupul. Nere la yela. Stapasa Niko United. It's very interesting. This is why I'm saying it's very interesting. Moti la hum piye ko. Hona le mosame ko. Ole mo ngota wa tamikuya Jalo ka ko VTM. Ko ele kono stapasa VTM. Ba mo kala Jalo masita oka. Mm-hmm. Both teams are on 20 points. Position 10 and 11. Eh, kena ko ya gore ba itshota o tlo gore ke mang o le ka ngolwa ka bo yo the go tswa mo the relegation zone between VTM and Masitaoka. Ya no team ya ho ke he kana VTM. No no. Yeah. I can't I mean I think VTM must have banale mo rale mo so that ba khona gore ba finge game ya bona mo Yeah on on Saturday last minute um yeah, boy, I get win. security systems. I was just <laughs> saying, like, I'm, I'm actually saying to you, I agree with you. Yeah. The confidence is still high. Yeah. The same can't be said. Gagosta Benzama I can't remember the last time they won a game. Mr. Paso Sama Jatara. Habasa draw zero zero bala tara. Habasa draw zero zero bala tara. There is something, but anyway, I remember the problem. Some go with VTM. Ham mahal masita oka hor kwane me hota zama katelen sinja. Muti laka musoko na le misami ko emi we yona ke tawe bila la muti laka musan. Not interesting one ka go VTM go le bagale gore VTM mara na tshwere metshame go e khatisa a re be le beka ha South Africa re le be le jalo gore gona Media TV Premiership mara ga gore metshame go a bone tshamikiwe over the weekend go ne re bana bo Orlando Pirates ba la thagelwa stopa sa Kaiser Chiefs se tsame ka maleka le fela le fela gona me e loko ya bone ye me ampile re ka le bela loka re be le metshame go e tshamikiwa mo tsetse la go mpie ko Mr. Pasa, my melody sound dance. Eh, back up on a jalo. Mr. Pasa, Richards Bay, ka half past seven. Sikukuni. In a Mr. Pasa, Cape Town City, ka half past seven. Amazulu. In a jalo, Amazulu. In a Mr. Pasa, Polokwane City, ka half past seven. Mr. Pasa, the most stressful team in the world. Kaiser Chiefs. Back up on a jalo. Mr. Pasa, Stellenbosch. Hali bella lo kwa yabu ano kwa reye me katelenza. Tata wane kare the leak is good as you know done. Koko bane. My melody sound dance. 
tobacco who demo bana jalo 46 points as the land wash balamos pan number two banana 35 points number four number three gusta pasasi kukuni got 33 points number four go lando parrots at 33 points five gusta pasasi passport united 33 points cape town city 32 points marcos ya must number seven got 30 points as topasa golden arrows bali most part number eight got 29 points got the sequa gusta pasa cape town spares on spot number 16 number 15 got richards bay number 14 gusta pasa chipa united arso jalo ka high dstv premiership level jalo english premier league or a morago ga metsamiko e samikileng over the weekend e bila pele ke go bolela loko metsamiko ya tswelela le bone ha ga re ga beke go ruitse re tabolwa ke go gata menwana me hela motsitsi la go mpie go re tabona jalo sta pasa so ba mogala ya Leicester pasa Everton ha re ga mtsa mka mengwe tsa mikwe a Nottingham Forest ina Leicester pasa Fulham me Leicester pasa Bailey bana le Wolves Leicester pasa Bournemouth bana ja le Leicester pasa Crystal Palace ha ya gona le the London derby between West Ham ga mmogo ja le Leicester pasa Tottenham ke ka ha ile gore mtsa mka tsela go mpeko ye me ka teng ke le mtsa mka ya English Premier League ye teletse mpele ke Liverpool ka 67 points mo ra Brighton over the weekend. Malika Manchester City ha mokole Arsenal and at his Asta Paso Saliva Pulumia Arsenal on spot number two by most banally sixty five points. Asta Pasa Manchester City by most spot number three banally sixty four points. Bango by Kilaba Tumela thirty seconds in Yana against Brentford. Can they have by two or they're gonna get a draw against Brentford? Manchester United, where are they? They are on spot number six. Basanta Balan to a horror by his top four, but by Penabasa Megajalo Champions League. Hotson Gohobone, Arabella. Ja lo ka kwa Spanish la liha kore. Mose si la ma abane ba le te ba na le mose hamuko ole mungo ole te ngo sa mikiwa. Reba na sta pasa Atletico Madrid. Ba fanya ja lo sta pasa Villarreal. Kan no te pedi ho ele ngwa. Ha le ba la loko ya bo ane. Bo ane ba Spanish la liha. Real Madrid. Ki ba na ba elongo reba ko huidimu. Ba na ja lo le 70. Barcelona, they are on spot number two, got 67 points. Girona, uh, the fairy tale in a corner, hello, go Girona, banally 65 points. Atletico Madrid on spot number four, got 58 points. Athletic Bilbao, 56 points. The battle, yeah, Champions League, Santi, Tan, Nathan, Honoho, Miriel Betis on spot number seven, number eight, Kim Valencia, number nine, Costa Suna, number ten, Gesta Passa, Villarreal. How about the bottom ten, yeah, boy, name is Simon Lagesta Passa, get tough, give me a better heart by spot number eleven, I stop pass. Uh, Las Palmas, Bamos, but number 12. All about Lagota, Sigoya, Almeria, Banali 13 points, Granada, 14 points, Mr. Pasa Cadez, Banajalu, 25 points. Ko Spanish la le ga re lebelela jalo seri a gore go iragala go tsamatsa majang gone ka ko o ka itse lo gore mo metsame ka bona le tse tsame ke le mo tsatsi la mabane re ne re bana sta pasa le sile Roma ba tsame ka maleka le fela le fela ga re nga metsame ko mengwe ne tsame ke wa ka itse lo re inta Milan ba le tse ba fanya sta pasa Empoli ka tse pedi go le fela me sta pasa Sao Paulo ba tsame ka maleka 1-1 le Udinese sta pasa ka Clary ba ne ba tsame ka maleka 1-1 le sta pasa the run. Holy Bella Liki, ya bone, Hore, Hone, Mia, Miang, Inter Milan, Kimon Bell, Hore, Bako, who demo, Banali, seventy nine points, Stapasa, AC Milan, Bako, who ba number two, ka sixty five points, are Juventus, Gilmos, but number three, ka fifty nine points, number four, Gustapasa, Bologna, Banali, fifty seven points, Holy Bella, got a sequa, Gustapasa, Salarentina, Banali, fourteen points, Hastapasa, Sao Sulum, Balamo, number nineteen, ka twenty four points, number eighteen, Gustapasa, Impoli, Banali, twenty five points, the game is having a Seri A, kahai long kore kana the locks tendin siya Seri A, kahai long kore ye me kate. Ari si jalo mo kotsa kwa la adina rebel la tama yo yo basketball NBA. Hobana jalo kore, what is happening? A lot is happening. We are nearing the playoffs. Me hao lebel la jalo me tamu kwenye tamu kwa jalo busi kuhari. Nerva na stapa sa the trail blazers ba fengwe ke stapa sa magic 103 104 stapa sa the nets ba fengwe ke stapa sa the pacers 133 to 111 has stapa sa the grizzles ba ne ba fengwe the pistons 110 to 108 mr pasa boston celtics ba ne ba fengwe stapa sa the hornets 118 to 104 stapa sa phoenix suns ba ne ba fengwe stapa sa the pelicans ba ba fengwe 124 111 mr hawks ba ne ba fengwe the bulls 113 to 100 and oh 100 
0.1101 yes ha le bala jalo tsa lock standings gore go eme ka tselentse nya dithapatselo gore motho ka re bone ba se tseba le show gore we are going to the playoffs gona le tselo gore di sansi di a go tsamaka the play in tournament advance to the playoffs we tsela gore top 6 ke yone le gore e show gore ra go tsamaka the playoffs and then be go nna le dithapatsen from spot number 7 to spot number 10 they are playing the play in tournament where we are looking for two teams to make the playoffs teams Eight or Kiddy, he's a little bit similar. Hola, Mahala Bella Jaloka, the Western Conference of Stapasa, OKC, Gana Thunder, Kimana by Long Horabako, who demum, a Matamikila Jalo, Matamiko, a Bawi name, Tamiko, fifty two, Bako Nova, Latala, Gilly twenty two, Olebella Jalo, number two, Yawa Negustapasa, the Nagas, number three, a Gustapasa, Timber Wolves, Stapasa, the Clippers, the Clippers, the Spot, number four, number five, Gustapasa, the Mavericks, number six, Gustapasa, the Pelicans, Dita Pate, Long Hora, as things stand, the Aho Tamika Jalo, the play. In tournament, you can pass Phoenix Suns, you can the Kings, you can the Los Angeles Lakers. I'm going to list the Warriors. Number uh, seven will play number eight. Number ten will number nine rather will play number ten. My whole level the Eastern Conference. You can pass the Celtics. Come on, my long hair. My cosport number one, number two, you get the Bucks, the Cavaliers. Number three, number four, you get the Knicks. Number five, you can pass Magic. Number six, you can pass the Pacers. Then I'm going to tell you this: I'm going to play in tournament. You can pass Miami Heat. You can pass Philadelphia six. Selling or jewel in bid is nearing a return cost up and so instead of stop us at the bulls. I'm more generally stop us at the hogs. Go on a high long word the NBA. Yeah, make a thing April 14. Likita way. Yeah, maybe this is my last time. Make a play in tournament. Oh, but I did a part. Then it's a tab and it's a tab. It's a tata rutel. Whatever who can say, you can the NBA playoffs. I'm going to say, 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 I'm going to the protecting the game. Hopefully today I'm gonna get my hands on that, on that copy. Book, I uh, need to read it. And I'm hoping that uh, definitely we will get to protect um, the game. Hopefully, mm, hopefully. hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> breakfast show this particular morning. I'm going to give you the 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 gun so you can shoot me. Um, this past holiday and one of the biggest things and I saw a post. Hello, quite a little No, yo. Customer KYC, mm. and uh, we know Corona, but so we we tend to be last minute people. Are you a last minute person? I'm not a last minute person. I'm one person who is what we call procrastination in English. I get mm. and uh, get like, get like, get like, all of you are doing how much you are doing because uh, I'm not going to go on and so road like you are the idea that I'm going to be a get like, get like, and then nothing gets done. So you think her early but one hour procrastinator because it, it, personally mm. um I don't know. I think it, it slips my mind because it's not like a thing of urgency. Mm. But yeah, no it be okay, um what am I immediately trying to do? Mm. And because it's not an immediate thing, get a bekelebala. How to leva now quedi hell out of the KYC Tebera who pitika or so I was seven if I can in a kid, Kilimola in a seven if I can or no whole game, it's all in a kiki register. And 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 it's so funny, um, in, in the sense that. Mm. And then and that's when you start complaining. Complain me how complain about so you did your part. Because when I then do your part, I will do my part. You had ample time to do that. Can the know your customer side of things? Just in, 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 in life, he a king. It's a don't procrastinate. Ensure that uh, you do your part. I will do my part. 
the same thing happened le tsone ka di top ba itse gore nyane me i think but one have gone to the point where they feel like we sort of king uh they'll extend la re ntse re sa tsa mai ya na they'll extend even so a post mo tla bua ya la ntse re nya a ka ka re paletse a ec ra ka ra khona go anything else but i don't i'm taking your message i can i told you you teach me every day so i'm taking your message and lo ena ke tsala gore o tle mo laetsa wa ga re se gore stop procrastination ha le gore lo ena o itse gore i have to do something do it now forget about it and then you don't the have the time to keep is now all right <laughs> now and mm. if you wanna know where you can go um for a bit of a boat cruise along the limpopo road we're going to discover botswana nerile kakokwadiwa kakwa ranch got the tuli block lots of beautiful birds lots of beautiful animals but you know what get to see it for yourself this is discover botswana at kwadiwa ranch in the heart of Tuli block this is what we mean when we say discover Botswana it was such a beautiful trip and it was exciting to see what we are looking forward to once we get here one thing I love about it is the beautiful welcome we have received from the ladies and the gentlemen around here so let's say cheers to Kwadiwa Ranch and let's discover Botswana As I wake up and I sunrise, ready to go on a boat cruise, I'm meeting my wonderful friends here. Very good morning to you guys. Hello. 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 Tastes really good. All right, so as you can see in the bar area, they can welcome you and have such beautiful drinks for you at your request for your special occasions. Now, this is a bar area, but you know you can have your version drinks, which allow for non alcoholics to have. And as I'm having, I'm holding my Guadira Sunrise, about to go see the beautiful, beautiful, beautiful sceneries of the Tulu Block area from the Limpopo River. Let's go. Um, as I'm standing here, we're about to go on our boat cruise and I can go to the bush bugs right here. I don't know if they are bush bugs or water bugs. Meaning that we are going to be very lucky today to see quite a bit of animals. Now right here with me, I have Aaron and I have Gerapete. These are the two men that will be guiding us through this beautiful um, scenery or, or terrain and let us know about all the animals and birds and uh, trees because that's one of the major sceneries of this area, right? Very good morning to you guys, gentlemen. Good morning, Lala. How are you doing? Good, good. good. Welcome. I'm, very, I'm very excited for this. So what can I look forward to? Well, we're going to share the beauty of the Tuli Block and Limpopo River with you today. Uh, already it seems like it's going to be a good day. Mm. Ipo is just behind us. Like you said, we've got some bushbuck around. So. Um, yeah, let's see what we see. Crocodiles, hippos, bushbuck and lots of birds. Ooh. And then beautiful uh, trees and, and so forth, the scenery. So okay, yes. We're going to share that with you today. And one thing I love about this is I have asked for some books, especially this is the one I'm looking at, um, The Birds of Southern Africa. So and know more about it because as you go on safaris, number one, you get to learn more about the animals number two you get to see them and number three you have you get to experience something like no other so let's go on this boat cruise and see what we can find today good morning folks on the mighty Limpopo river Karapet is my name as your guide but for safety as the kickstart as we maneuver within the mighty Limpopo river for a boat cruise we are already putting on our life jackets and also let's avoid putting our hands for a long time on this rail because some other species they target easily when the hens are leaning out. But for the first species that we attempt here is the hippopotamus, amphibious, Greekically. We tend to call it the water horse, so we can maneuver with them the mighty Limpopo River.
last sighting here by Lala spotted this uh, massive crocodile within its territory kind of but here normally as we know crocodiles they depend on sun but even though they stay in water but here it's just like sun busting And just like that, we have arrived. Ritza from our boat cruise. Zizi was the most amazing guide ever because we got to spot quite a few animals, birds, and learn a lot about the vegetation in the area. Some of the animals we spotted, of course, um, yours truly got to spot the first Nile crocodile, a very big one. Um, it was really in the bush there, Sabona, listen, and using your sharp eyes, which I will remind you that if you're going on cruises, you must make sure that your eyes are sharp, Luena, so you can spot these animals. I got to spot the first Nile crocodile. We saw a couple more as we went along the banks of the Limpopo River, but also the things that are the So much more that we got to see, but we'll be going on a game drive a little later on um actually tomorrow morning we'll be going on a game drive and hopefully we can spot some land animals and but for today and now we're about to continue our sightseeing by seeing the facilities right here at Kwadiwa Ranch let's go see what they have to offer The Breakfast Show, proudly sponsored by Botswana Post. I hope you enjoyed that little clip that we have um, to discover Botswana Luena. Um, take this moment to say, you know what? What a beautiful nation that we have and what can I find and explore as I move around it all. And getting into our first conversation for today, uh, we're talking project management awareness. It's running into a very um, interesting time of the year, the 2024-2025 um, financial year has begun in April Jana. So you know what the projects are starting, everything is starting. So as you find yourself finding a project, what can you do? So joining me, we have the president of PMI, that is Project Management Institution um, of the Botswana chapter. This is Ray Puseng Chikanda. And joining me also on the red chair, we have Medjulia Gawarekwe, who is the launch committee um, chair of PMI. How are you? Yeah, good on you? A very good morning to you. Good morning. Hey, can you give me a hug? I'm a tona. I have such a rack. I need to project the rack. I need to management. These are very big words. Um, thank you so much for both of you uh, for joining me today. Uh, PMI Botswana, Project Management Institution Botswana. Lee Rang Halako, Project Management um, PMI Botswana. Uh, go PMI Botswana. Re Rutueta. But institutions, entities, everybody, who mm -hmm. uh, the project management skills to implement projects. Mm -hmm. uh. So it's not just for individuals. Can I not consider you have to go to an institute? Or can you worry? Um, kiki na kile na lady hela keta kuwe bikeza na kiki 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 tu ta kilo nose. It's also for businesses and more institutes. Yes. Okay. We we actually also want the government to mm -hmm. to join hands with the government, especially the Ministry of Transport and Public Works because they implement many uh, billion pula projects. Mm. Uh, or Ministry of uh, Water, Land and uh, Sanitation, yeah. uh, me, they also uh, do a lot of uh, projects for BTC, parastatals, for the Pswana and uh, other parastatals. Mm -hmm. uh, they need to really uh, consider project management as part of their uh, skills development mm -hmm. in, the, in those entities. All right, Julia. Um, that would be like a, what is project management? Because before you find interest in something, mm -hmm. you have to um, know what it is. So that would be like a, what is project management? 
probably maybe briefly on short just to define it's just the process of methods that you use on how to implement projects mm. you know because there are those process that you follow like Rich Kanda was saying for it when you have a lot of projects there has to be a way on how they are run systematically so we have those yeah, processes <laughs> you have to learn exactly how to do it. Yes, because there's a methodology because at the end of the day you want to deliver a project that is of quality, mm -hmm. also save on the cost. Mm -hmm. And you know, output that has to have an, an impactful added value. Mm. Yeah. And I think that's, w mm. I was going to get to the question of the importance of yeah. project management. Yeah. Um, done right, what would you say people really need to like think about project management as? Because now consider we just think of it as a cost. Um, but what is the importance of doing project management, having those skills before you start implementing a project? You, <coughs> before implementing a project, you need to have a, a structured approach. Mm. A, first of all, you have to know what you are going to do. And for you to know what you are going to do, you have to collect the requirements, mm. what the client wants. Mm. And then you take that over-changela into activities. Mm. Mm. And then the activities, they were the time. Mm. Uh, the cost. Uh, the quality perspective. That's one. Mm. Mm. So that is the quality management. What's an amo? Um, both materials and resources, mm -hmm. human resources, physical resources. risk or what can stop me, mm -hmm. and what advantage uh, is on the way. If your weakness is that you don't have project managers, then you have to procure. Mm -hmm. That is from outside for about the Batanamo project in Yahao. And I'm thinking this is a part where you'd say PMI would come in, um, yes. um, project management institution. Um, so, how long are the public wants to be part of PMI or they've gained interest. Um, what is your, what can you tell them, what do you guys specifically do to help them? We have. Uh, we have an association or a chapter, Busana chapter, which will be launching in April. Mm -hmm. Yes. But all in all, we also have a Facebook pages where they can learn about our chapter, what it does, and all that. Because mm -hmm. one more thing, the PMP examination. Okay. Yes. Uh, for you to become a professional. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> so, a chapter, what is the chapter exactly? I think Rich Kanda would add on to that okay. to make it more uh, 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 brief in terms of explaining. But in terms of people or the public, it's important for them to join the chapter mm -hmm. so that you can learn about project management. Mm -hmm. How project management, how we are going, not only thinking about engineers, you're only talking about people in construction, mm -hmm. you understand? It also spans across even to invest management, this project management. Okay, yes. Yeah, even yourself, you need to manage yourself in some way. So that's project management. <laughs> yeah. So you manage your activities <laughs> as well because that's yes. where it all starts. Uh -huh. I would normally say that project management is not an isolation activity. You need to put it into a lot of things. Mm. A, for you to manage your things effectively and efficiently. Got where there is a plan, where there is you doing something, yeah. you will need to have some sort of um, project management within that. Um, can we just get into, yes, Hanaron, Utan, Twisanya, and I don't know how to go about the chapter. Can you just let me know? Yes, a chapter is a branch. It's a branch. Uh, our mother body, Eco USA. A project we do out the project management institute mm. uh, global. Okay. Uh, it's 1969. Mm. Then uh, it's a non-profit making organization. Mm. So 
e dira gore e nne le di branch all over the world okay so it's a branch but one chapter is a branch of that and it's a chartered branch of that and affiliate the mom of the affiliate i love the fact that um hali bagore um, the, the mother company is outside it shows that you are also bringing skills that uh, make people uh, you know they can they can be on a global market instead of just thinking of botswana tlare be hela project management the hello gore um you don't have these skills. You don't have this awareness. What could go wrong with your project, Tanzu Simola, Mungwa Kenyan, or your your project plan, um, if you don't incorporate such things? Um, you definitely are going to have problems because so Santa how to hear a short analysis. The Arsimola la hono ho how to hear it so that matata how to haka akato haka. E lo gona ka o kono ro diri se because you are not structured. Can I only project management? You by the time nothing, you know where to go. If you have to identify the before, which is called uh, 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 risks. You are the identifier before, and then you would prepare it. Hey. What am I going to do? Yeah, okay. I'm going to do that plan, I'm project management plan. Then, I don't know what to do. If you don't know what to do, a sensitive thing, say you don't know what to do. So you will then have to destroy and redo again, which is a cost. So I only project management to set to it. You've already that. covered costs before you have to cover costs. Yes. <laughs> 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 All right, uh, Genia, so yeah. I want to talk, we're getting into uh, the, the financial year, okay? Yeah. It's starting, this is where, you know, funding comes in. This is where everybody needs to, to be starting to think about their projects, their project management, what exactly is needed, what, where they should go, quarry, and that's why you're here. All right. Yeah. Um, uh, do you have any advice, Okabula Lambatana, or this is an important thing that you should be actually looking at before you even start applying and applying yourself to those projects? Yeah, because we are living in a project economy. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, it project is what drives our economy now, and it's important for us to actually have those project management skills, actually to have those valuable projects that we can actually say what, but this is what we have done, and this is the output, and it has to be measurable in a way, and it's important for companies, organizations, ministries, actually have those project managers because you don't want a situation where you have a project, a multi-million project, mm. it has failed, you understand? And then you have put the resources, you have put everything there, mm. but what was the reason? You'd find that probably it was probably poor communication. Which Just if you, small little things that were very avoidable. You see, yeah. so if you had those, uh, 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 the risk uh, mapped out clearly, and you know what, but this is what I'm going to, in terms of communication, in terms of collaboration, you're going to involve all stakeholders beforehand and after, because it's important as well. You know, the commitment you also measured as well, also mm -hmm. have that bit of compassion, you understand? So these are the four uh, C's of product management, you know, that every other manager would have, and would we say that you need to have if you're a product manager. Mm -hmm. So that actually brings out one of the best project, uh, product management that you would as an individual. So with yeah. management, you have a very high chance of winning. <laughs> yes. Yeah, because when you do a project, you don't plan it to fail, right? Yes. Yes. So now you're making your chances more. Even if it doesn't come 100%, it will come at least 99, 90 percent Yeah, because at a level of 5%, you yeah. know, certain things will not go well, but you don't, you would have planned for those uh -huh. things. What if it happens, what am I going to do? Okay. Yeah. Uh, and then I want you to just say your, your words of, 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 of encouragement. Um, more this financial year. What is it? What is the important thing that they should bear in mind? Well, they should bear in mind that uh, uh, projects do fail when they don't have uh, management. Okay. So, um, for them to be successful, they need to engage and the project management skills. Mm -hmm. eh, the, even the, the entire team, because the project manager, Motirong, eh, eh, doesn't do uh, the individual activities. Mm -hmm. eh, he makes sure that, Kanashi makes sure that those people are well eh, eh, financed, everything, mm -hmm. everything on the way, mm -hmm. eh, so that the uh, whether it's the engineer or the a accountant or everybody well, is comfortable. Exactly what they're doing. They, they know exactly what they are doing, when and how, mm -hmm. and how to measure their own 
uh, work. Okay. Yes, and also make sure that uh, they engage all the stakeholders because stakeholders can stop the project. Hey. So you have to. House. Yes. I think yes. I'm very convinced. If I yes. start a project in the first place, I'm coming to is you guys <laughs> so I can learn yes. Um, yes. some skills there. Yes. Um, but what are your contact details and where can we reach you on the social media platforms? We have our Facebook page, yes, PMI Botswana Chapter. You can always look out for our events there. We also have an event because PMI Thursdays. It happens every other Thursday of the month. Mm -hmm. This Thursday, we're actually hosting one. Mm -hmm. You can just come and enjoy and see how Or you just get a feel of it before you're fully invested in it. You know, because yeah. there's, a, there's, there's a speaker who speaks about a topic in point management mm -hmm. in detail, and then you have a group where people discuss. So you got to learn, you understand? It's... It's a learning environment, mm. you know, it's very conducive for everybody. So you can always come and join us as well, because we do that every other Thursday at the end of the month. Okay. So this Thursday we're holding it called Cresta. Okay. Yeah. Mohaboron. Mo, mo Mohaboron. All right. Um, Rechikanda, thank you so much for joining me. Um, Julia. <laughs> Same age was. <laughs> uh, thank you so much for joining me. Kitsa na gore a le batsana ba lutu le ba itse gore nyame ha ile gore ba batla go simela da projects what they shouldn't do and what they could do and kitsa gore ba tai ba tai na ka re rona na ba tla ba bona gore ba ka ithuta mo go lona. E le gore ba ka join na. Le ka join and learn. And learn. Yes. yes. Thank because you. when they are there it's cheaper for them to do to do yes okay. we tell her the half price and all that okay yes. so half prices everywhere it's cheaper for you to do um knowledge is always free it's all about you finding the right knowledge that can help you on your journey of life on your project we're starting this year um the financial year strong so let's get all the information that we do they are pmi botswana chapter you can check them out on the socials Ita remote sasing la kamoso hebere kubuka ne holo kongwe kwe longhare kota bholo inchi ajalo buka ya protecting the game buka e longhare to be launched by Ashford by Melody kana mutakare e kwa dule kera Ashford by Melody ana lova longhare ba na ba mutu sa hali le hali it's a book of so many chapters and the titles are very interesting kure oskawa na kuchwere ana isman lona kita lo bolala longhare le kaya kuere kaka and everything. But it is a book of 12 chapters. So what exactly will be happening? Are you guys invited or not? Good morning, Ms. Kay. Protecting the game. Finally, I have my hands on the copy. Let's just do, you know, a reminder to someone. Just to, you know, give them the heads up. What really inspired Bra Ash to sit down and say, you know what, let me write something. Yeah, that, that's correct, Miss K. Can you remember that I was at the BFA for a decade, 10 years? as a general secretary or CEO, or whatever you want to call it. Yeah. And, you know, this was the foundational stage of, of football uh, in Botswana. And clearly, we, all of us were learning on the go. So the that I just felt, um, given my experiences with, you know, institutions like the media and the public in, in certain instances, that one, I, I just felt obliged that, you know, there, there needs to come a time when I relate the inside story, if mm. you like. Yeah. So the kind of people don't get to know everything that goes on. There are a lot of perceptions. Yeah. And I'm hoping that I will have dealt with some perceptions. I can't finish it all in one book. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, you have been in the game for a very long time, Abra Ash. You have mm. gone through, I'll say, literally everything that one has to go through in the beautiful game of football. Why did you decide to start or write about your 10 years at the BFA? I mean, um, we can talk Kosafa, we can talk FIFA, you can talk <laughs> AFCON 27. <laughs> There's a lot you can talk about. It, there was actually a suggestion, Ms. K, that I put it all together. And I felt, no, no, the, the foundation, which was the Botswana Football Association, where I really cut my teeth, was very important for me. 
So, uh, and, and it gives me um, a springboard then to have your Kosafa on board. We can write about the 16 years at Kosafa, 16 years at FIFA, you know, and of course, like you said, the one that I'm really already <laughs> under pressure to write about. Uh, we want to know a lot about that one, yeah. Yeah, perhaps it, it may overtake both FIFA and others. Uh, it looks like it may because... It should be the next. It should be the next, yeah. if you say so, Mr. Yeah. <laughs> I'm saying that. It yeah. should be the next. But, you know, Braesh, let's talk about, you know, um, this book, Hore. I was saying it has... 12 chapters. Chapter 1, taking the game to the people. Let's just do a brief summary of, you know, mm. Chapter 1. Indeed. Chapter 1 um, basically explains, well, when we got in um, around 1989, um, 89. yes, there were a few issues that we knew uh, were confronting or challenges that were confronting Botswana football. Uh, one of them was uh, football wasn't organized all over the country. Uh, Kalahadi was not organized, neither was Chobe or Nghabe. Uh, they did play football, but it was disorganized football. Yeah, yeah. We needed to put structures in place. So that's one element that, that takes, that's why taking football to the people. But then, of course, another one, and I think that chapter follows very closely, is to move Botswana away from your international friendlies on independence day <laughs> because that was our international football we decided a uh -uh, time is now that we needed to compete uh, because if we, if we didn't compete miss k we'd still be 40 years behind everybody else but now we decided to compete and it wasn't easy because people enjoyed Bogana Batarababeza, Bozambia Batarababeza, not knowing that these are not really the, 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 the real teams. Yeah. So we decided, no, the mindset needed to change. And thankfully, the executive was unanimous in doing that, hence the employment of Ben Goffey uh, to take this, to take us forward. And, and we don't look back. There was a period, Miss K, where the zebras are called the weeping boys of Africa. Yeah. And they were indeed. But Ben Coffey had warned us that, you know what? It won't be an easy ride. Mm. You'll have to really weather the storm. <laughs> yeah. We did. Ben Coffey and football development. 89. Yo, Kore Witzigin, I'm so lucky to be um, <laughs> sitting here interviewing Raesh. 89, some of us are not even born. I'm just saying. Can you imagine? <laughs> Can you imagine? And then there is the brush up with University of Botswana students. I think this one, for me, the interesting thing is University of Botswana, we are taking schools now, Raesh, and you know, you are at the high level, really the adminia football monohai. Mm -hmm. Yeah, obviously the, it was topical, Miss K, that zebras are losing all the time. And people are really getting frustrated, angry, and <laughs> I don't know, I don't know how to describe it. And of course the university students would pick that up. Um, they, they, we had two, two, two initial, uh, two contacts with them uh, without reading the whole book to you. Um, one more extension just opposite the, the, the hospital Labala GSS just we had an office there, extension ten, I think it is. I'm not sure. Um but it did go um they came in big numbers. We used to have a beautiful garden. We didn't have it after that visit. But basically to come and express much and thought about fila or Timmy Ijo Atata Maybe Ben Coffey must be fired after the after the CEO fires Ben Coffey. The board must also fire the CEO. <laughs> you know those sort of things. You know, Miss yeah. K. But uh, it, it was interesting. <clears throat> and then, of course, <clears throat> we were able to address that without any difficulty. But then I didn't really worry about these sort of things. And then they they invited us to the university there to come and explain. And that was about two years later. Um, but I, I go, and, I, and Ben, uh, Kofi was reluctant, and I said to him, Ben, this is an opportunity for us to go and explain what we are doing mm -hmm. to people who are very important stakeholders, because University then they will help us sell the concept. And one, one area that we put forward at the time, it was applicable, was that we are not getting enough government support. And, 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 and I gave examples of why I'm saying that and which countries, how countries were doing in other places in oh. Africa. And, and, and there is, that, that, that resonated with them, you know. So, yeah. so I said to Ben, you know, we have to, we have to share. So Tadala, this is why this book, to come and try and share 
Miss Kate Tranche. Yeah. Um, what exactly is happening tomorrow, Bra? Ash, I was saying tomorrow is the book launch. Mm. Um, where is it taking place? You mm. have worked Coco Safa, FIFA. Um, mm. Can we expect visitors to be in the country for this book launch? Um, I, I'm 100% I'm, I'm aware that um, there's a team from Kwasafa led by the Executive Secretary Sudis Toombs um, and maybe four others. <clears throat> Um, I'm expecting a good friend from South Africa, Thomas Gwanaita, to be around. Oh. Um, unfortunately, people in Europe, although they were invited, it, it's, it's, it's quite far to travel mm. for a launch. Um, and some of them may join us via video link. Mm -hmm. We are still working on that if, it, if it's going to be possible. Yeah. But yes, I'm, I am ex we are expecting quite a lot of friends. We, have, we are going to Setoa Park, uh, Setoa Office Park. Well, that's where it will be. Um, invitations have been sent already. How go, Mike? We trust, we <laughs> trust that we, we haven't forgotten anybody. Yeah. But it's not too late. It's only Tuesday. They'll forgive you. Uh, it's not too late. Uh, <laughs> it, uh, to, then, of course, we were restricted by the space, Miss K. We yeah. didn't, it's, 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 it's a restricted area. We'd have loved to have everybody uh, at a place like the National Stadium, for example, yeah. Where, yeah. where we can't fill it, you know. But, you know, for those by Longara, unfortunately, you don't have advice. Uh, where do they get the book, Raesh? Where can they buy it and how much is the book? The book, um, up to tomorrow night, is 300 Pula. But then beyond that, it's going to be 350. Um, we are negotiating with the uh, Choppies Group, who are actually part sponsors of tomorrow's event. Uh, to sell in select stores. But I like another idea is to bring it as close as possible to, to, to Botswana. Yeah. And, and, and we know Chopis has a footprint in many places. We are, however, trying, we're still negotiating to have a second launch in Francistown. When you read the book, Ms. K, you'll realize that journey really started in Francistown. Um, I was in Francistown when I was called up to come and serve in what was called an interim executive committee of the BFA. Mm. That's really when the journey started and yeah. So um, we will try and explain uh, soon after the launch uh, which, which, which stores are going to have the book. But of course people can contact me directly, Ms. K. Yeah, um, where, where are they? I'll, I'll, have to be, I'll have to be uh, uh, on call. Um, mm -hmm. my, you want my number? You, if you're free to give them your number then. Seven two. Right. Yeah. One zero zero five double four. I thought you knew it, Miss Kelly. <laughs> no, now I have it. <laughs> <laughs> now I have it. it was for those very long hair banana. But um, hanga ko bota bra eshwar mobuke nye your highlight or your favorite chapter kefe. Don't say all of them. I I, I love all the chapters. Nah. I think they're all very very important. But the one that really got me nostalgic to a certain extent, Miss K, was the abundant family life because mm -hmm. um i skipped it intentionally um, yeah <laughs> <laughs> um, um because Ms. K, it, it 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 was real yeah. um the, the one thing that i didn't do correctly in football was to be over passionate and i'll never teach anybody to it's okay to love the game to work very hard for it mm. and i'm hoping that's what young people will pick up from this book hard work um, but I, I went overboard. Mm. Uh, I, I want to tell you this on, on, on national TV that I'm lucky to still be married <laughs> thanks to football. It, 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 was, it was that bad and it's yeah. in the book. People will see that. So like I said, all the other chapters are interesting for me. I think um, uh, operational matters, you know, we traverse issues around court cases. Remember that used to be the way to go yeah. while well, you are not there, but when you are still a little baby, that's, that's <laughs> what we used to do. Go to court, Hatimi Saitumela, we'd end up in court and, and it was fun and games, but we survived it all, Miss mm. K. Uh, 10 years later, I was able to say goodbye and leave. Right, the next book that Raesh is going to be writing <laughs> from, you know, protecting the game is the, the bid, the AFCON bid 2027. That one is very interesting. 30 seconds, Raesh. Football club moments. Mm. Club moments was our interaction with clubs. If you remember, Miss K, well, you don't, but I'll tell you. <laughs> during our time, the National Executive Committee, imagine how bad it was. We were actually running everything. No secretariat full time. Um, until I was appointed in 93. Yeah. Um, but, but, you know, so even the league, we were, run, we were running it. 
clearly this was not right and I'm happy that we introduced structures to make it all of, almost independent uh, as it is now. So, um, yeah, uh, it, it's those sort of things. Praesh, um, congratulations. This book, yeah, can I show you that? Not only Bazwana, but people by long they love um, football, they follow the beautiful game. I'll definitely see you tomorrow as we'll be launching Protecting the Game. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you, Miss Kate. It was a pleasure. No, I'm not inviting myself, my director. I'm officially <laughs> invited. Um, <laughs> protecting the game. So it will be the official launch of this book. Social media. Literally everyone is on social media. Go to the Facebook page. It will be protecting the game by Ashford Mamelodi. You can follow us. 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 So you know what to do. You want to know the history of Botswana football. A lot of it is in here. And now we are now. Mata zila labo bedi re kaga na katse lenzi nyalo re se kwele la labo e mesenta kwere mato le tse tila ganya adwe la bota na breakfast show ikibira karabo miske bo sen until tomorrow bye bye. Lush green, pristine and serene. The breakfast show decided to take a breather from the city and we are all the way calling Soilet Tauko Lion or Rock Farms where it's all about farming, um, camping, they also have the most beautiful landscape and that's exactly what caught our eye, making our way, way here to see what they have in store for us. How to bring your farm to life, make it green and beautiful as you can see behind me. I got to walk around for a bit and I saw a couple of uh, fruit trees, banana lady lemons, they've got even the olives which was very interesting to me they also have apples and guava trees but also I know I'm a lover of trees I even have a phone app that teaches me how to find the coolest trees in the vicinity so they give one beautiful petunias some succulents and a lot more but we're gonna find out um, from the farm manager in just a bit her name is Pauline uh, Pauline Mompati will be with her in a bit to find out what more um, they have to offer from this farm but also how they upkeep it and make it as beautiful as you can see it. For one to have these breathtaking views, a lot has gone into upkeeping this beautiful farm. But joining me right now is, is the farm manager of Lion Rock Farms, Kibu Aja Anakenali and Pauline Mumpati. How to upkeep such a beautiful farm, where it came from and where it's going. Loni Yarona, Ibidua LM Grass. Kiloni Elimori, Yoneka Buyoni, Aspre, Debe Kono Kavara. Area ra e e e e e ye inti mana konye kuchani kapeke lo ne lungori hai katiwa esala i inti patahani ilin tengi ya kwa nguri i withstand e um boikiti ba kahai katiwa ngate mo mo grassing rnali mostly this succulent plant zai lungori zani rudi topi le kama ba kahori they can withstand a harsh condition more especially during na kwa yadi winter and also again the water requirement they are taking high ko dimu dimu unlike the crop usage ni kauta hapa harinzi na rtsama tsama ja na mpansa ground covers can you tell me the difference between the ground covers and the grass lo gore why le dirisa grass yena um le haletseng tseng di ground covers ke ne le ditsenya ho ebile what purpose do they serve e be rena le di lawn cover di ground cover tse pedi 
tsone ke tseleng gore ga di ha o dirise lon mowa da e khodisela ka botsone be di spreada tsone advantage ya tsone ke gore di evergreen ha di affect week di temperature tse di harologaneng mo lone nya rona mo iri a reng eleng gore re ilimile re likile ka bojothe gore re tsenye di indigenous plants tsothe ke di thare tse tse leng gore ha ile nako ya dipula di tshentsha matharateng ana green gape di tebe di khothagana di ha moriti we leng gore mongwe le mongwe ka o eletsa gore a nne mo gone e be re nna le di thare tse dingwe gape di succulent plants traditional le bo di snake plant di aloe vera le bo di cactus e be re nna le le di di hard material tse leng gore ra di dirisa nna le matapa midi ya di thare di thito tsa di thare le tsone tsone le tsone e mi ya teng ke go ha that natural feel ya gore o bone gore everything can be used for decoration Pauline ke tsala gore golo gore le hilo le le nne le ntle jana there is a lot of maintaining that happens how uh, do you go about the maintenance of the area re dirisa crawl manure ke ne le ngo re te be re spread around then we water more because loni ke so se le ngo re sarata metsi the more we no se tsang ga pet the more e golang ka teng so tsantse gore constantly we nne we more e be go nna le di thare tse leng gore di surround le this indigenous trees tse leng gore re di jwa di tsone le tsone every time di a gola e be di tswa in shape so every time we go around them e be inspect our how many should be done then e be ra locate na go ya gore ra ro di shape leng then also again e be re bona gore re ka eda which other colors my especially ka hore khona o dirisa le bo di petuni ya ga phele bo di marigold lona ja ka o ipanela o tsontse bo ithutile a thing or two about keeping such farms first things first to know how to use your environment to your advantage ja ka le bona all the trees the di thing but there is it's i'm just cutting them and trimming them to make a canopy that can help you so uh, much with the shade and also using the manure from your farm animals u di tsenga into your grass the type of grass you use how we talk or it spreads out and it can help you um keep it green all throughout the year also one thing that i learned that was very very um uh good knowledge for myself you knowing how to which trees to keep so you can have evergreen farms knowing to choose your succulents um and your cactus trees is a very good point when you have harsh uh weather such as molintsole tawjana ke tsala gore lena we tutile a thing or two and you're going to make your farm as beautiful as ever we'll maybe visiting you very soon so work on that farm and make it green and lush jaka ke ntse ana i'm going to get my hands dirty but i love our city girl but today i'm going to show you that i'm a farm girl i'm going to mow the lawn What's your question? Sir, I'm scared. Yes, but I'm ready to move this year. Now, I'm ready to move. I'm ready to move. I'm ready to move. This morning, I'm going to go to the Red Red Wanda Matambo, and I'm the managing director of Co Cat Leapy BW. I'm hoping we're going to get a little noise. Yes, that's correct. All right, let's just get straight into it and tell us briefly about who you are and what exactly you do and what your company does. Thank you so much. Cat Leap is a company that specializes in electronics and innovation. And uh, the reason why I'm here this morning is to talk about one of our innovations that has hit the market, which is called the Chedza Solar Backpack. Mm -hmm. uh, basically, it's a backpack that's made from durable um, canvas material, our local canvas material. It's got an LED bulb. It's got a, a backup storage battery, which can last uh, eight to 10 hours. Mm -hmm. uh, you can also charge your phone. So in the event that there is or you don't have electricity in rural areas, you can also use that bag, you know, to um, power boost your phones or also for lighting, mm -hmm. you know, in rural communities. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, that is why I'm here today. Uh, I'm also the managing director um, for the company, Kid Libby. Um, I'm also the business consultant, mm -hmm. uh, which uh, I'm consulting for other local youth uh, in Botswana. But mm -hmm. we are proud to be here today to showcase um, our Chedza Solar Backpack. Mm -hmm. Such a very cool innovation that I get to see. Um, why did you choose to go uh, the backpack route? When we were doing our research, um, we always take time 
to see what the problems in Africa are. Mm -hmm. And um, on one of our trips, we saw a young man, you know, who had so much potential. And this young man was carrying some books in what seemed to be like a plastic, mm. you know, and that touched our hearts. And this was a few years ago, this was almost three to four years ago. And when we got back to office, we said, we need to help this young man. What can we do? And we used our passion and our drive to come up with a solar backpack where mm -hmm. we said, listen, we can offer this young man free electricity mm -hmm. through lighting and also help him to carry his, back, his books in the backpack. Mm -hmm. And this is how we came up with this Chedza solar backpack. Mm -hmm. Chedza meaning light. In our meaning light. Years. Oh, okay. And one thing that, I, that, that, that people usually get to say, Barata um, Khori, does a solar that quite expensive. How affordable is this backpack? Um, because it's made from durable canvas mm -hmm. material, um, individual backpacks are going for about 893 Pula. Mm -hmm. um, and then corporate backpacks, because they buy in bulk, we have uh, uh, partnerships with um, other stakeholders that mm -hmm. are buying in bulk and donating to rural communities. Um, those are a bit cheaper depending on the quality. Um, and also we have a first generation, second and third generation mm -hmm. uh, backpack. So it also depends on which generation our clients are going for. Mm -hmm. Lovely. And in terms of, uh, should I say lifespan? Yes. Um, each bag can last you between five to ten years. Oh, is it? Yes. Okay. That's why we made it from durable canvas material. It's also waterproof, by the way, mm -hmm. and also heat resistant, which means that it can also, um, um, it can, it can subdue, it, you know, it's, it's very rigid, it's mm. hard. So it can, it, it can, it can withstand all the heat, um, you know, of, of our, our country. Mm -hmm. Yes. And w w one thing I know that uh, you've been to different summits uh, across the world. Um, uh, what is it that uh, you've taken and now you are imploring it into the Botswana market? Well, thank you for that question. Um, firstly, our team has done so well yeah. in the past, um, you know, three years. It's been a very painful journey, but we've, we're thankful that we've come this but far. But good. But good, very good, <laughs> yes, very good. Um, so we've got the opportunity to, to travel outside of Botswana. We've actually won awards. We won an award in Dubai as well. Uh, we also won the Seed Climate Change Award. We also won um, Best Youth Innovation in Botswana last year. Mm -hmm. And we've also been um, nominated to go again, you know, into uh, other conferences and other regions um, this year. And for us, that means expansion. That mm -hmm. means taking Botswana out into the world to showcase what young Botswana are able to do and also offer a competitive plane, mm -hmm. you know. And we've been asked this question, what is so unique about your product? Mm. The I, I was yeah. going there. What's, <laughs> what makes you different? So, so, so backpacks exist in the local market, but we have been able to put a backup storage battery into the backpack. So what we're basically saying is not only does the backpack last you longer, you can also power boost it using a USB cable. You mm -hmm. actually okay. charge Lovely. the backpack itself. Mm. So this means that un unlike conventional backpacks, which you can only use, you know, when you travel, when it's in the sun, this one can also be charged with electricity when the electricity is there. And when there's no electricity, you can also just, it's, it's got the backup battery and it also lasts you. So you've got a, a dual um, combination there. Oh. Going on. Lovely. And uh, how do people get a uh, hold of it and hold of you? Thank you so much. Um, you can reach our offices. Our contact number is 72135676. I'll say that again, 72135676. Our offices are based in Block 8. Mm -hmm. That's where our workshop is. People can place orders. We do have a lot of demand for the backpacks, uh, so they're moving quite fast, especially out of Botswana regionally. Mm. But um, yes, uh, people can reach us on our office number. They can uh, look at, uh, for us online as well. Mm -hmm. We're available, uh, Kid Lippi. Uh, they can look us up and um, yeah, we, we, we're happy to attend to people. All right, uh, Mr. Tawanda Matambo, it was a pleasure having you this morning. Have yourself a beautiful day. Thank you so much. Thank oh, you. Your pleasure.
Brought to you by Botswana Post. Rise and shine.